Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sheridan. Today I thought I would film a little Alphalete sixth birthday sale try on haul and also compare some of the new stuff I got to some of their older collection. So if you're interested in some of the things I got from the birthday sale or any of the other pieces and my opinions on them, stay tuned. So to start off, I am wearing the Revival jacket. I think this jacket's very, very similar to the Amplify jackets that just released. I don't think you can get this anymore. Um, but then I've just paired this with the Revival shorts. These are a four inch inseam. Um, both of these are kind of old, but still super cute. I will go ahead and zoom out and show you. This is probably my favorite collection so far, which is the Revival collection. They also make leggings but I snagged some Alpha Lux, some Amplify, some new joggers, and yeah, so I will try everything on for you and let you know how I like all of their new collection compared to the old stuff. Okay, so I ordered two separate packages from the birthday sale just because there was like things I really wanted to get that I wanted to make sure didn't sell out. And then I went ahead and went back and snagged a couple more things. I'm still waiting on my second shipment. I think it'll be here probably in the next few days. So I'll do like another film of that. But in my first shipment, I got black Alpha Lux essential leggings in the size small. I also got this signature fitted crop t-shirt. I have this in a few other colors and it is my favorite t-shirt to wear when I'm working out if I don't feel comfortable enough in just a bra because it's not baggy and like showy like other things. It's nice and fitted and it cinches you like right where your waistband would hit. So it's very, very flattering. I'll try this on. And then I also snagged these lilac joggers. I love Alphalete's joggers. I have a few pairs. These are the essential joggers. And then I also brought out the, these are some Amplify leggings from the previous Amplify release, not the birthday release, and then these are Surface Power leggings. So these are both kind of new, I would say. They weren't launched during the birthday sale, but they were launched like fairly recently. Um, so yeah, I thought I would try these two on, so then that way I can give you kind of like a revivals with the shorts, the Amplify with these leggings, Surface Power with these leggings, pair of joggers, and then the Alphalux leggings. So I kind of have one of each material so that I can compare and tell you guys the differences. All right, so these are the Amplify leggings. I don't know what color they are. I wanna say it's just burgundy or like Bordeaux. I am obsessed with these leggings. I think I like these more than the OG Revival leggings, which is the same material as the pink shorts I had on. Those were my previous favorites, but I think the thing I like about this is it's slightly thinner fabric without being see-through. So like, Squat proof, that's sorry, that's weird, but it's still squat proof, but it's still a little bit of a thinner fabric. It has that like three tiered waistband that their biker shorts from either their spring or their summer launch had. So it really cinches you up here and like kind of tapers your waist in with still having good like lower belly support. The biggest thing I like about them compared to the revivals is that they don't have that like line detailing. So I feel like I can kind of dress these up if I wanted to. I have a pair in black and I feel like I can get away with like putting on a cute sweater and some booties and wearing them out because there isn't that like athletic detailing, which is cool. They also have that new booty scrunch, which normally I don't like. I used to have some old Gymshark leggings with the booty scrunch. And the thing I didn't like about those was I felt like the scrunch was, was so low that it almost looked like my butthole, if you know what I mean. That's like, yeah, anyways, um, but this one sits like pretty high up, just kind of like right at the, the base of your tailbone. So I feel like it does a really good job like cinching you in without looking like wedgie. Does that make sense? I mean, I'm a big fan of the wedgie. I, I, I yank all my leggings up my butt, but you know what I mean. Okay. Okay, so I just threw on the fitted crop and you see what I mean? How it like, well, obviously it's fitted, but it's not baggy like other crop t-shirts. It cinches you in so nicely and it hits exactly where like the top of your waistband would hit. 
It's the perfect like little crop that cinches you in, makes you look cute, you're still in a crop, but if you're not comfortable showing a ton of skin, like with a sports bra, like sometimes we just have those days we don't wanna wear sports bras, you know? So I like throwing one of these on, it's cute also. I cannot tell you guys how many times I don't shave my armpits or I forget to shave my armpits. I'm not about to walk into the gym and a little freaking sports bra and be like, oh hey, like sleeves are short enough that it's not restricting. Like if I'm gonna raise my arms, sometimes t-shirts have a lot of material right here and it feels like you can't get a good range of motion. Okay, so next up I put on the surface power leggings. These are apparently different than the surface path leggings. However, I don't really notice a difference. Um, so there's the surface path leggings, the surface path laser cut leggings, and then the surface power leggings. I feel like surface power leggings might have a little bit more of like a spandexy elastic feel, but I think they fit exactly the same. The material feels the same. It's kind of like a brushed fabric. Okay, so here is a more zoomed out look at the surface power legging. I'm really bad with their color names. To me, they're just blue, but so it has this cute little tapered waist. On days that I'm not bloated, I love these leggings because it just like accents your waist, shows off the abs, but they're not compressive at all. This waistband is very stretchy. So if you're having like, if you're on your period or if you're just a little bloated, definitely go for something like the Amplify that's going to like snatch you in. This will not do that. These are very much like second skin type leggings, I would say. Okay, so moment of truth, I'm going to be trying the Alphalux Essential Leggings. I have never tried these before. They're not really new. Um, I've just never tried them because I like the Revivals and the Surface Leggings better. But a lot of people are saying that these are like Lululemon dupes. Not that I have ever owned Lululemon or I've never worn a lines in my life, so I don't know how helpful I'm going to be. But... First impressions, they're very, very soft. They feel similar to the Surface Power Leggings. They have that brushed feel. They're a little more like silky, if I, I don't know, I don't know if that's like a good way to describe it, but the Surface Power Leggings are a little more spandexy, still brushed, but like spandexy, definitely a little more athletic feeling. These are very, very silky. I got black. Um, one thing I like about these a lot compared to any of Alphalese other leggings is there's no like spunky detailing on it. There's no side stitching. There's no like laser cutout. There's no, there's no nothing. These are just black leggings. Okay, the lighting kind of changed. So we're facing this way now. Sorry, my kitchen's dirty. But last but not least is the essential joggers. I love Alphalete joggers. I've said that so many times. I cannot find a better jogger. I'll wear these on leg day. I'll wear these on upper body day. I'll wear these when I'm working from home. This color is really, really cute. I don't have like anything purple, so I wanted to snag these. They have pockets on the sides. They're zippered, which is awesome because if you're working out and you want to throw like your headphone case or your keys or whatever in here, you can zip it up and nobody, like they're not going to fall out. Very, very cottony, very, very soft, very, very like fabric-y. I don't know if that makes sense because this is all fabric, but I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. Very, very soft, like just clothy fabric, like pillowcase fat, pillowcase fabric, or like jersey. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> but yeah, they, they tie, they snip to the waist. I don't know anything about clothing. I hope this is helpful, but... Okay, hello and welcome to the second part of this Alphalete video. Finally got the second one. Um, so the first thing I ordered in that package was this Amplify bra. I get a size small and I have to say, I think this is my favorite bra that Alphalete has ever done. This is the first bra that feels like a true small. This is a small, it fits perfectly. So I think they've like fixed their sizing with bras if you've ever noticed that. And apart from this bra, I also got another fitted crop in black um these are really really cute there's literally deodorant on it because i wore this to the gym today but 
super simple i think these are like 20 bucks it says learn more dream more be more more athletic -y than a t-shirt material like it definitely feels like it has some type of spandex i guess i can actually okay yeah 94 percent cotton six percent spandex so it's very close to like t-shirt material but it is very stretchy and like wicks sweat if that makes sense like you can get lighter colors and i personally don't find that they show sweat i also got these amplify joggers brought out some revival joggers to compare these are the revival joggers from god i don't even know maybe last summer or something hey yeah actually scratch that these are extra smalls so i got a small in these these are extra smalls i still wear these and they're great my lower body has just grown a lot in the last year so i'm now an official small so I guess if you're in between small and extra small, this one's for you. I don't know if you can see that. There's about an inch or half an inch on each side. I'll line up the edges on one side. So yeah, there's like maybe an inch and a half more in the waistband. I actually like the small better. I find that this waistband is so cinching that I get like, I don't know, it like pudges out on the side because it just cinches me too much, if that makes sense. I think the lengths are pretty similar. I'm struggling so much. So other than the waistbands, it looks like the lengths are almost exactly the same. They're the regular shorts. They have a four inch inseam. I think these are eight inch inseam, but the regular shorts I love, but also you can't, I can't do leg day in them because my booty cheeks hang out, but they're great for anything else. I think they're the most flattering shorts, but I like the biker shorts for leg day because I can hike them up so they're still flattering, but I know I'm going to have like a big, chunk of fabric not showing my butt cheeks these are the biker shorts before i've hiked them up this is where they normally hit one thing i really really like about these is that they don't squeeze my thigh they are very like loose and stretchy right here so it really just sits on your skin i know that that like i don't know what it's called but i know a lot of people don't like that with biker shorts usually what i'll do is i'll kind of just pinch and grab till it's at about my mid thigh so like Maybe two inches higher um i just find that's more flattering on me then i'll kind of just try and spread out the the scrunches all over but yeah so then this is kind of what it looks like when i wear them i don't know if you can see but the waist has that like tri band that the old revival bikers have and then i think the new amplifies have these as well but yeah thoughts i didn't go through everything that i own from alphalete but i tried to show you the new products i got and then also kind of compare to other products just so you could see like every type of legging final thoughts amplify is number one the amplify leggings the amplify biker shorts like they're so good you can't beat the tri waist you can't beat the booty scrunch the fabric is amazing it's very similar to the revival fabric but i like that it doesn't have that lined detailing that the revivals have the only thing that like depending on my mood and my body that i like better about the revivals is the solid waistband sometimes if i'm bloated this try one it's not as tight at that bottom kind of like in the tummy pouch area where the revivals is just cinched all around but this does taper you in so much better so amplify is number one revivals are so 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 close to second sometimes they tie depending on my mood third favorite leggings is definitely the surface leggings surface path surface power um, they're very similar to me. I love the V waistline. I love the material. I would not repurchase the Alpha Lux leggings. That's just my personal opinion. They were very warm and they also, I, I just had to mess with them a lot. You know, like I don't think I would ever work out in them because I felt like I had to keep like pulling them up and like getting them to sit where I want, where with the surface leggings, the revival leggings, the amplify leggings, like once you like mess with them, scrunch them, hike them up, whatever, they stay put, like they will not budge throughout your whole workout. So yeah, I would not repurchase Alphalux. I know there's different types of Alphalux, but I feel like I'm just not a fan of the material. As far as bras go, this revive, I keep saying revival because I'm so used to that. This Amplify bra is definitely my favorite bra that they've ever done. I already like want to get a bunch more. It's just so basic in the front, but cute with the cross in the back and like, so flattering, I feel like, but still super supportive. Fitted crop tees, do not sleep on those. Those are my favorite product. If you want to buy and like rep Alphalete, but you don't want to spend $70 on leggings, 
get a fitted crop like they're so cute they're super flashy if you want that like alphalete branding you don't have to break the bank to own alphalete with a signature fitted crop i hope you guys enjoyed this video it was a little chaotic i've never filmed a try on video before um, let me know if there were details I missed that you want to know more about. If you have questions, let me know in the comments below. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will post more try on videos in the future. I might do like a full workout collection if that's something you guys want to see. Thanks for watching.